A bumper recruitment coming up for engineers. 295 vacancies by NLC Limited India. Yes, a Navratna PSU under the Ministry of Coal has announced the recruitment of 295 engineers through Gate 2023 score cards. Right. So, when you know, I always keep telling you, hard work, hard work always paid off. So if you worked hard for Gate 23. You know, there are several notifications coming up, coming up, coming and this is another one such case. So just, you know, uh, three days back, there was also a short notice. Okay, uh, there was like a press advertisement that NLC had posted and now today, that is 20th of November, the detailed advertisement has been given. So you can go to the NLC India website to the careers page and you'll be able to find this. So once you open the detailed PDF, there will be a PDF opening up. Okay, so let's go to that PDF and let's learn about all the possible details. Okay, so NLC. Okay, a quick update. Let me give to all. Okay, so quick uh, uh, update is 295 vacancies. But how they are broken, what branches they have been inviting. Let's learn all about that. So it's a Navratna PSU as we all know. Okay, now let's come into the notification part dear. Vacancy part first of all. Okay, then salary, the selection procedure, everything has been clearly mentioned in this. So if you have a look into this dear. Mechanical. So now there are two areas where they are going to recruit. Okay. Thermal power stations and renewable energy and next is going to be for mines and allied services. Okay, so for mechanical, have a look into it. 36 in the area 1, 84 in the area 2, total good opportunity 120. Electrical students, okay, 71 in the area 1, that is thermal power station and renewable energy. 38 in the mining, total 109. This is also a very good opportunity for electrical engineering aspirants as well okay moving ahead to the other branches so there are few for civil as well 15 and 13 according to total 28 for core mining students it is 17 only in the mining area and for computer science also okay there are 18 vacancies in the thermal power and there are three vacancies in the mining total 21 for computer science aspirants this sums up to total of 295 the branches as per different the vacancies as per different uh, categories are also mentioned you can go through that as well okay now okay now some important points to be noted so as i clearly mentioned in the beginning as well yes this recruitment is purely going to be on gate 2023 examination scorecard of your relevant gate code okay only and only 2023 gate score will be valid right so like if you are mechanical or mechanical and production you can apply provided you have appeared in the gate exam through the mechanical branch only not the production branch only me okay similarly full time uh, or part time bachelor degree in electrical electric and electronics power engineering will be acceptable and your gate paper should have been doubly right your gate paper should have been doubly similarly civil or civil and structure but gate paper should be civil cs c computer science engineering computer engineering information technology etc gate paper should be cs and mining gate paper should be mining minimum qualifying percentage okay in your bachelor's is 60 percent and 50 percent for SCST candidates okay now, next important things that you must be aware about is the age limit. So, here even the age limit is considerable. Okay, you will be uh, you are given the age limit up to the 30 years. So, normally at the PSU, so it is 27. Okay, and now very important thing that attracts you. Okay. So have a look into that. Okay, you will be first absorbed as graduate engineer, tra uh, sorry, graduate executive training GET, and you will be undergoing a training for one year. Okay. Now, during this one year, you will be paid a basic pay of 50,000, some applicable DA and common allowances, which will be 35% of this. Okay. Okay. So, your graduate engineer trainee post will be under the grade E2. You directly start with grade E2 in the training only and the pay scale uh, for E2 is 50,000 to 1,60,000. The annual CTC is 13.32. But as soon as you complete your training after one year, you will be directly absorbed in the E3 grade. Okay, and your pay scale will be 60,000 to 1 lakh 80,000. Basic pay becomes 60,000 and other all benefits you will get as you always get in the PSUs plus, plus, plus stability factor. Don't forget over and above all of this stability factor. Place of posting have been mentioned. Okay, the place of postings. I think it was mentioned earlier only. I think I missed it. Let me go through it. If you want to know the place of posting, yeah. Okay, so for thermal power stations, it will be Tamil Nadu, Rajasthan and Uttar Pradesh. For renewable, okay, it can be in various states and union territories. For mining and allied services, it is again the state of Tamil Nadu, Rajasthan, Jharkhand and Odisha. Okay, so the place of posting as per the area of working is also mentioned. Right. So, I have mentioned you the pay scale. It's a very, very decent salary. Now, method of selection, dear. 
नेक्स्ट इंपॉर्टेंट पैरामीटर इज मेथड ऑफ सिलेक्शन एज आई टोल्ड यू इट्स गेट टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थ्री स्कोर कार्ड फॉलोड बाई इंटरव्यू बट द वेटेज ऑफ इंटरव्यू विल बी ट्वेंटी परसेंट द वेटेज ऑफ गेट स्कोर विल बी एटी परसेंट सो इंटरव्यू विल बी देयर बट नॉट अ वेरी हाई वेटेज ट्वेंटी परसेंट वेरी नॉमिनल मेजोरिटी इफ योर गेट स्कोर इज गुड यू हैव हाई चांसेस ऑफ गेटिंग क्वालिफाइड इवन इफ यू हैव अ वेरी डिसेंट टाइप ऑफ इंटरव्यू नॉट वेरी गुड एज वेल ओके बट यू कैन ट्राई टू बी गिविंग गुड ओके द स्टूडेंट्स कॉल फॉर पर्सनल इंटरव्यूज विल बी इन द रेशो वन इज टू सिक्स ओके वन इज टू सिक्स लाइक वन ट्वेंटी पोस्ट फॉर मैकेनिकल सो इट्स सेवन ट्वेंटी स्टूडेंट्स टू बी कॉल्ड वन जीरो नाइन फॉर इलेक्ट्रिकल सो हाउ मच इट सिक्स फिफ्टी फोर स्टूडेंट्स विल बी कॉल्ड लाइक दैट ओके लाइक दैट द कैंडिडेट्स विल बी कॉल्ड फॉर द इंटरव्यू अन अदर इंपॉर्टेंट अपडेट अफकोर्स इफ यू क्लियर द इंटरव्यू एज वेल इफ यू आर फाइनली सिलेक्टेड यू हैव टू गो अ मेडिकल एग्जामिनेशन वेरी नॉर्मल प्रोसीजर ऑफ रेगुलर फॉर्मेलिटीज okay there will be a bond as well of 3 lakhs but that most of the psus are asking these days and now there will be the application fees of course for uh, unreserved ews and obc candidates uh, 500 plus 354 processing fee 854 for sc st pwd candidates or any ex servicemen okay there is no uh, application fee but processing fee plus gst is still there that is 354 okay now some more important dates yeah i'm sorry now coming to some important dates okay yeah here it is so uh, like the notification as i told is floated on 20 november but the application online registration it will be online registr registration only and it will start from 22nd of november okay morning 10 am and it will be live up to 21st of december up to 5 pm so you have almost entire one month but if you are sure if you performed good in gate 23 and if you want this why to wait uh, fill the form as early as possible avoid the late uh, last moment uh, hazels okay so this was a quick update coming up from nlc a big vacancy 295 is a good opportunity for engineers okay majorly 109 for electrical 120 for mechanical and then there are vacancies for computer science civil as well as mining aspirants okay stay updated to our channel for more such updates and you know keep if you are in case preparing for gate 24 or 25 keep preparing hard as well because for you also several vacancies which you don't realize right now which you don't understand but they will keep coming so get your scorecard ready with you okay bye bye thank you stay safe and take care of yourself